welcome everyone who is here in the room and will be watching by recording. This is Dr. Alana James, and today is the first of a series, a suite, we're going to call it, of um, talks, webinars about transferable skills. This was driven by one of the deans of the universities uh, that uh, we do business with, and people like lucky enough at TAM UCC to uh, have our services as part of their university work. And their dean told me some stories about um, some people who came out to certify their marine program and commented that most of the people, most of the PhDs at this time, were going to be uh, then moving into industry and questioning whether or not all the things that were needed for masters and doctoral students to really take their place as the leaders that they deserve to be um, were being taken care of. That's a that's sort of a a long story, but uh, it amounts to the fact that we spend a lot of time in school. We spend a lot of time focused on our thesis or our dissertation, and then what does it take to uh, train to change those skills out? for industry. So that's our conversation for the next several weeks. <clears throat> You'll be able to go to uh, the bigmarker.com space and sign up for the rest of them if you find this one to be helpful. So where are we now? Teamwork is the ability to work together towards a common vision. The ability to direct individual accomplishments towards organizational objectives. I think that second sentence is really key. The ability to direct individual accomplishments toward organizational objectives. <clears throat> Those two sentences together for me say it's about the whole team, but it's also about the individuals getting what they want, being able to put their self and add to it the most that they can um, as well. and then make it good for the organization or the school or whatever. So the task for master's and doctoral students will be uh, to develop situations within your schoolwork that allows you to build this particular set of skills and what they are and what they amount to will go through. So our agenda, and we'll use the same same agenda for all of this particular suite. Um, first, we'll discuss what employers want from masters and PhD leaders that they hire. Then we're going to know, uh, have a conversation about what is known about the topic of the week, uh, what you can do in graduate school to build the skill, and then I'll finish with other resources. Hopefully, that sounds just like what you came here to listen to. So, what do we? employers want in their master's and PhD students. And I have a, hmm, a bias that master's and PhDs are the right people to become leaders because the skills that we teach have a lot to do with how we use uh, our ability to research, how we think about complex jobs, um, complex situations situations, our ability to be innovative. There's all kinds of really good things that come out of graduate work. But So what do employers want besides those really good things? Oops. Oh, dear. It looks like the slides. So... I will have to redo this. Let me go to, I wonder if I can go to screen capture. Some days are just filled with technological challenges. Let me go to screen capture and, and um, bring up the slides. That I was just working on because clearly when I told them to build a PDF, they didn't do so.
Here we go. Nope. Oh my goodness. Now I'm concerned because I closed down a set of slides that was all finished and it isn't the one that's opening. Hmm. Well, I don't know how this happened, but I will talk through what I remember, what I know about the slides, and then we're um, those check for me, will you? Did the slides I uploaded do they look like these that um, that don't have much in between the main headers? If one of you would open the ones I put up in handouts. Somewhere there is a full set of slides, but they aren't. Um, Hi, Nikki. You're not missing much. We're having a technologically challenged day. So has somebody got the, let me go back to audience. Well, I'm going to stop the recording because this one isn't going to get recorded.